Okay, so now that I have my photo matched in place and I've gotten rid of my um, scale figure and I've gotten rid of my little cube, off to the side I have some components here that I've saved. I've got a bar, a bar kind of island, and I've got a table. I just want to see what both of these look like. So I'm going to copy the bar first, go back to my scene, and I'm going to paste it, in, just not in place, I'm just going to paste it into the model. And it's coming in at, at the wrong angle, so I need to go ahead and turn it 90 degrees. A little difficult to see some sometimes, so you gotta kind of maybe move out of your match photo. And then I go right back to that same shot. I'm gonna select this, move it back into place. If I come out far enough and I grab it from this bottom point, I can actually see the green line match up with the exterior of that wall. So I can even see what it would look like if it was lined up with the edge of that wall. And of course, it's right up in our face, but this is really where it would land in the space. If I wanted to, I could then put this on its own layer, do what we did with the, with the um, space plan uh, assignment, where you could actually make a layer called island and then turn it off, make a new scene, all that. But for, just to, for the sake of time, I'm going to go ahead and hide that one and then just plop this guy in place too. So again, I'm copying the table and then I'm going to place it in the model. And this time I'll go ahead and leave it turned in this direction. So I could essentially show someone really quickly, this is what it would look like in this space, and this is what this would look like in this space, without having to go through the trouble of modeling all of this. I can just use this to kind of conceptually visualize what I want to do. So for this, um, for this match photo assignment, what I want you to do is just choose either the interior or the exterior residence, and add some components of your own. If you choose the exterior, um, or, or even if you want to just make a few of your own models. I really just want to see that you know how to match the photo and that your perspective is looking right. So uh, choose one of these, either, either of these two photos, and place a component or make your own little island in this one. If you choose the exterior one, go ahead and add in some plants or add something to the side of this building, a trellis or something like that. Um, anything to kind of show that you've left your mark. Um, it's really just about making sure that you know how Match Photo works. Alright, that's that.